Kipley Brown. And I'm Christopher Beaworth. Here's our top story. Bill Clinton's speech Wednesday night at the Democratic National Convention in Charlotte received rave reviews. Of course, it wasn't the first time Bill Clinton got a warm reception inside Charlotte. <laughs> the Romney campaign says that Bill Clinton's convention speech supporting President Obama only shows he's a good soldier. The statement marks the first time the Romney campaign has mentioned the word soldier. <laughs> Runner's World magazine has proved that Paul Ryan was not being truthful when he claimed that he ran a marathon in under three hours. The magazine suspected Ryan of lying when they noticed that there were words coming out of his mouth. <laughs> Apple has sent out invitations implying that the iPhone 5 will be released on Wednesday, responded an Apple fan. Um, I hope that the announcement's correct because that means starting Wednesday, uh, I get to complain that Apple hasn't released the iPhone 6 yet. <laughs> I'm still a virgin. <laughs> Mark Zuckerberg has sworn not to sell any Facebook stock for at least a year, mainly because the world has sworn not to buy it. <laughs> On Monday, Prince Harry made his first public appearance since nude photos leaked of his trip to Las Vegas. In other words, he made his first public appearance since his first pubic appearance. <laughs> Pu yeah. They made me say that. It's all right. That's all right. I'm, I just offended myself. <laughs> At Thursday's MTV Music Video Awards, British boy band One Direction won Best New Artist, which means that they're headed in one direction, <laughs> downhill. Also at the VMAs, Chris Brown won Best Male Video. Brown beat the other nominees so badly, he started dating them. <laughs> and speaking of the VMAs, now, where hard news meets Hollywood, here with the entertainment news is someone you'll find on the VMA's best dress list, and she's the host of Jersey's show. Uh, let's try that again. And she's the host of Jersey Shore After Hours, our own Amy Paffrath! <laughs>
Claudia Suleiman claims to have never heard of Mitt Romney. This could spell trouble for Romney since her womb has three electoral votes. <laughs> the Oogie Loves in the Big Balloon Adventure <laughs> has broken the record for the worst opening weekend in box office history. It was so bad they've already signed Adam Sandler to be in the sequel. <laughs> Sorry, this movie sucked lately. <laughs> Jack and Jill was a masterpiece. I don't care what anyone says. A new study finds that people have the most sex in bedrooms that are decorated with purple, and people have the least sex in bedrooms that are decorated with rush posters. <laughs> Funny, because it's true. A German farmer is in hot water after accidentally growing marijuana instead of sunflowers. <laughs> Which could also explain why his carrot patch has been sprouting Twinkies. <laughs> Doctors say an epidemic of human brain parasites has taken root in California. Their victims are called Scientologists. 